You're watching Local 5 News. We are Iowa. All right, welcome back. Joining us now is Joseph Junta, the maestro of the Des Moines Symphony. And I understand, Joseph, you guys have a big event coming up this weekend. We do, yeah. This Saturday evening and Sunday afternoon, the Des Moines Symphony plays its second Masterworks program, and it's going to be a winner, and people are going to love it. I just heard from the weather guy that <laughs> yeah. the weather's going to be great, so we're looking forward to it. Yeah, that's going to be awesome. And I understand you also have a special guest joining the event. We do. Uh, each one of our concerts, we bring someone of world renown. Uh, fame and uh, Charlie Arbright is my, our guest. He's playing a beautiful piece by Rachmaninoff, the Rachmaninoff yeah. Paganini Variations. Charlie's been here before. You can see there that his flamboyant personality is sort of infectious. Yeah. He's a great engaging um, uh, artist and th he happens to be playing um, a part of Liberace there I think or something. <laughs> but, but Charlie's a great guy and will do a great job yeah. with this piece. Well if he's having this much fun I'm sure people in the crowd are going to be super engaged. We have a great time at the symphony, you know, and we try to break down all those barriers about having to, you know, get dressed up and all the things. We just want people to come and enjoy the music. Don't have to know anything about classical music. Just let the music wash over you. Yeah. And I can guarantee every listener that comes to the Des Moines Symphony for the first time, you'll feel better going out after the concert yeah. than you did coming in. It's something that's really magical about great music, and uh, we look forward to, yeah. it, to, to serving the community as much as we can. And for the first timers that are going to join you guys, what can they expect? What is that experience like? Yeah, uh, it's just a sort of like a magical experience. You come in, it's 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 you know you sit there and you listen, and there's not. Um, it gets your attention, it engages you, and to see these uh, 95 fantastic musicians that whose all their heartbeats are beating as one, and we're playing, you know, this great suite from the Firebird of Stravinsky. We start out with a, a piece that's based on uh, piano rags by Bill Bolcom, a living American composer. Um, it's just a terrific concert and a terrific way to take just a couple hours out of, out of your life and uh, spend in any way that the music uh, uh, allows you to go. It's sort of like a, a dreamlike state, yeah. except it's a, it's a great relaxing way to, yeah. to enjoy the evening. And where can people find information about these events or just other events that you all put on throughout the Sure, year? Uh, all information about the Des Moines Symphony is on dmsymphony.org and um, anybody that wants information can uh, get on that website and it's uh, easily accessible. Tickets are still available. The concerts are Saturday night at, at, eight, at uh, 7.30 and Sunday afternoon at 2.30 in the Civic Center of Greater Des Moines. Yeah, and what's it like for you to be on that stage and to have people in the crowd just kind of admiring what you all do? <laughs> there's no uh, there's no feeling like it. It's very hard to, to put it into words, but uh, you know, I, I'm in the kind of business that the concertmaster walks out, tunes mm -hmm. the orchestra, I walk out, and before I do anything, the people applaud. <laughs> it's just the, the weirdest feeling, but the talent that my musicians have yeah. is just remarkable. And uh, they're engaged, they're gifted, they're, uh, they give me all they've got to give, and uh, I try to inspire them and uh, do the best job we can. But it's a pretty special experience with the Des Moines Symphony. Awesome. Um, anything you're looking forward to with the big event? Yeah, uh, not not just this weekend, but uh, coming up soon in the middle of November, we've, we're, we're doing the planets with a wonderful NASA film. Oh, that's, that's be cool! Fun, great fun. And then, of course, we always have our annual New Year's Eve program that sells out. So that's okay. going to be a big night for us. We've got two singers coming in playing Frank and Ella. So that's okay. going to be great, great fun. Cool. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us today. Hopefully you all can get out and support them this weekend. So um, thank you so much for joining us. My pleasure. Thank you for having me. All right.